Brenda Lee, rocking around the Christmas tree. What a fantastic Christmas song. So in this video, we're gonna learn how to play it. I use the capo on the first fret, but remember, you can move the capo up and down the neck just to suit the pitch of your voice. So don't forget you can do that. Now we're gonna use the old faithful down, down, up, up, down. It's got a nice bounce to it. So first of all, for the intro, we can play a D, a B minor, a G and an A and you can do them just in one strum each so three four two three four G two three four and A two three four so for the verses we're going to go a D an A7 an E minor 7 back to an A7 and a D. So that goes like this. I'll try and go a little bit slower. So we're going to go rocking around the Christmas tree at the Christmas party hop. Mistletoe hung where you can see every couple tries to stop. Now if you noticed there was only half a bar between the E minor 7 and the A7. So let's have a look. We're going rocking around the Christmas tree at the... That's for two bars. And then we're going two bars of A7. Christmas party pop. Then we've got E minor 7. Mistletoe. And then an A hung where... Back to E minor 7. You can... Back to A7. See every cup. We'll try to stop so you want the A7 and the D and we'll go back to the start rocking around the Christmas tree have a to the A7 happy holiday E minor 7 little wheel to A7 have some E minor 7 pumpkin pie A7 and we'll do some carols Now don't forget on the seven chords, if you don't know a seven chord, just take the seven off the chord and then it takes it back to the original chord it was built on. So if you know an E minor but you don't know an E minor seven, what you would do is you just play an E minor because all E minor seven is is an E minor with an added seventh note of a music scale. So if you don't know that, then just any chord that's a seven chord, just take away that seven and it'll still sound fine. It won't clash with anything else, especially if you're playing in a group. Now for the chorus, we have a G, we have an F sharp minor, ooh, bit of a bar chord. Then we have a B minor, we have an E7, and an A7. So we're gonna go two bars of G, two bars of F sharp minor, two bars of B minor, an E7, we're gonna stop on there, and then an A7, okay? So we're gonna go, you will get a sentimental F sharp feeling when you hear B minor for two bars, voices oh, singing, let's be jolly. E7 and stop, deck the halls with, then it an A7, boughs of holly. I'll just run through that slowly. You will get a sentimental F sharp minor feeling when you hear B minor voices singing. Let's be jolly. E7. Deck the halls with boughs of holly. And there we go. So if you found that helpful, please could you like and subscribe. And let me know if there's any songs you'd like to cover or anything you'd like to tell me on how you're getting along. Okay, until next time, see you later.